There's no strings attached here, just a giant puppet walking the streets of New York. Little Amal is a 12 foot 7 inch tall puppet that represents a little girl, a 10 year old girl from Syria who had to leave her home in Aleppo to search for her mother because of the violence of the war in her, com in her home country. This walk is celebratory, but with a strong message about the urgent needs of migrants and refugees. Little Amal started her journey around the world in 2021 and has already traveled through more than 85 cities and 12 countries. Her visit to New York comes at a time when the city is experiencing an influx of migrants caught in the middle of a raging political battle over immigration. The main message is these are people, these are human beings, just like you and me, just like our family members. And these are not just uh, political issues that we can ignore, right? We need to uh, really see the human side of immigration and migration and the global refugee crisis. And we need to respond in a very human way. The puppet was designed and built by Handspring Puppet Company, known for creating the puppets for the international hit play War Horse. She's built from robust but lightweight materials, and it takes four puppeteers to bring Little Amal to life. I don't think I've seen the city um, as obsessed with a celebrity as, as I've ever seen, you know, the past 10 days or so. Um, so it really has been phenomenal, and it's um, wonderful to see just how these different neighborhoods, these different communities, these different organizations have really embraced uh, Little Amal and been affected by this project. Little Amal invites us all to imagine a world in which care is prioritized and we look at all of our resources and we recalibrate them to make them just and fair for all human beings who are here on Earth trying to make their way into a future that is healthy for all of us. Before coming to New York, Little Amal had a range of experiences, among them posing at the Eiffel Tower in Paris and visiting the United Nations in Geneva. <laughs> With thousands of newly arrived migrants now in New York after being bussed from Texas, a message of compassion is particularly timely. Jody Jacobs, CGTN, New York.